The USS Barracuda SS-163 was the lead ship of its class, known as the V-Boats, and was named after the Barracuda fish. It was commissioned on October 1, 1924, and designed to meet the fleet submarine requirement of 21 knot surface speed for operating with contemporary battleships. The submarine was equipped with two Bush Sulzer direct-drive six-cylinder two-cycle main diesel engines, each with 2,250 horsepower, and two auxiliary diesel engines, each with 1,000 horsepower driving electrical generators. This setup allowed for battery charging and augmenting the main engines for maximum surface speed. The concept of electric transmission in a pure diesel-electric arrangement, later employed in successful fleet submarines during World War II, was tested on the Barracuda. After being commissioned, the Barracuda served initially for engine trials as a surface-running vessel and then conducted cruises along the New England coast and the Caribbean Sea. In later years, she served along the West Coast, in the Hawaiian Islands, and the Caribbean. Her name was changed to USS Barracuda in March 1931, and she was reclassified as SS-163 in July 1931. During World War II, the Barracuda joined the Pacific Fleet but completed six war patrols without encountering any enemy ships. In September 1942, she returned to the Atlantic Fleet, underwent repairs, and was converted into a cargo submarine, significantly reducing her speed. She continued to serve in training exercises until her decommissioning in March 1945. Ultimately, the USS Barracuda was sold in November 1945, ending its operational life in the United States Navy. The submarine's contributions to the development of submarine technology, particularly in testing the electric transmission system, played a role in the success of later fleet submarines during the war.